Ben, a bad day at the office. 3 uh, 0 defeat in the FA Trophy today at uh, Seven Oaks Town. What's your immediate thoughts and feelings after that? Uh, obviously, it's disappointing, mate. I said um, in the pre match notes, I said that we were looking to kind of progress uh, in one of the FA competitions this year. Um, we, we were hoping that we could use the disappointment from the Ashford game when we knew we should have you know, put that to bed at home, uh, use that today, but unfortunately it wasn't to be. So, that, yeah, there's obviously a lot of disappointment. Um, because you know it's a competition that we that we respect and wanted to go far in and, and give people a good day out and play against some top sides, but unfortunately it wasn't uh, wasn't to be. What do you put that down to today? I mean, I'm sure you pre you know the team prepared well, done you know all your usual homework on the opposition. Is there anything? Was it too soon after the game to know? Is it, maybe you need to review it over the next few days? What's your immediate thoughts on you know what was today down to? Yeah, obviously in terms of the full review, you you have to do that kind of once you've got home and settled down. You don't want to go off, um, you know, your your kind of adrenaline after the game and after a loss and, and, and trying to look into things that you know you probably don't need to. Um, but I think you know we. We gave away two penalties that, for me, you know, it, they were just. The second one is hard for me to comment. I did, I did feel like maybe Carl got kicked rather than the other way round, but that's, you know, it, it, in any case, it's still, you know, both of them were poor, defending a little bit lazy, you know, could have, you know, really been, you know, could have been sorted. Really, I think, you know, we missed two clearances for the first one. Third, you know, we, we end up taking the, the, the fella down. Um, you know, I don't think there was much quality in, in from us, and, and, and especially when they went to ten men, we didn't really utilise that um, enough. And I said at half time, if there's if there's one team at this stage of the season, you know, with, with, within a short period, that's going to know about uh, you know teams going down to to less men on the pitch and having a bit of more fire in their belly than they did when they, there's eleven, it, it's us. Uh, we you know we spoke about that at half time. Um, we moved the ball too slow uh, in the second half, especially on the pitch that it was. Um, you know, we should have used that a lot more than we did. I thought we had chances at times, you know, but we, you know, unfortunately, the, the kind of decisions, you know, that we were up against, uh, you know, t sucked a lot of life out of it for us. I think. You touched upon uh, their penalties. There, obviously, they got two penalties today to make it two nil and three nil. There was a key couple of minutes um, at one nil, where down, obviously, when we were attacking, Jeffro got clattered. Um, and the referee gave a free kick. I don't know if it was right on the line. I couldn't see it from where I was, where they placed the ball for the free kick, yeah. if it was right on the line. Um, so what did you, did you think that was in the box or not? And and is on the line, I don't know, is on the line in the area nowadays? And also, obviously, straight, you know, two or three minutes after that, up the other end, penalty the other way. Yeah, I mean, listen, it, uh, you could so it could have been 1-0 and then it's 2-0. You could tell from where, obviously, the ball was. Uh, of how close it was if it was outside um, you know I, d I don't even think you know there was a few inches in it but you know it's, it's down to the ref to call that um, we're obviously wanting a penalty for it it was a very clumsy challenge from from the centre half I don't know how he didn't get punished you know in terms of you know cards and things like that but you know it's, it's one of those you know we go down the other end um, and don't, don't deal with a ball into our box and mis, misjudge two clearances that results in a penalty, unfortunately. So they're the margins, unfortunately, um, that, that weren't really on our side. Two questions in one here. I mean, as is, was today or is today a reminder that despite our good start, obviously four out of four in the league, that there's still a lot of work to be done? Uh, and two, as a manager, what do you say after a... How do you approach things after a performance and a result like that? Do you kind of... Let things stew, or do you, you know, do you go over the game with the players over the next few days? Something else, you know, kind of. Well, the, how do you approach the next few days? And the obvious, the obvious, obvious thing is obviously, you know, we're, we're disappointed in regards to the result. Um, I think the way we we spoke about obviously our good start. Um, unfortunately, when you're when you're going up against teams in the FA Cup, it's it's a it's a it's a competition that obviously means a lot. Um, not only on the pitch but also for a club so it's something that was you know was on our mind to, to progress to next round um, when you're playing in these type of games no one no one cares about your league start it's, a, it's you're playing against teams that you don't you. really know they don't know much about you we don't know much about them so 
it's a it's, it's, a, it's a free game. You you know we're four out of four in the league. That it doesn't mean anything. Um, it doesn't mean that you're better than someone else. You know we've had a good start. That's all it is. And you know the, the season ain't done in four games. So we, you know that 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 is you know something you know that we'll, we'll touch on. I think what we said at the end there. I said you know. We, it's kind of one of the first defeats that we've, you know, first time we've come away from a game where I think we can be you know, disappointed uh, in terms of the way we've performed. Um, obviously, the, the other loss against Ashford was was disappointing in its own way because we didn't put it to bed in the in, in the first game. But I don't think we played bad. I think today we, we, you know, we weren't at the levels that were required. But also, you know, going down to ten and conceding two penalties, you know, it can can bring disappointment. Um, my message to the players at the end, you know, is. And, and it was a lot of the fans' message at the end. Tuesday, um, Tuesday goes back to the league. You know, we'll look to continue our strong start. Um, and you know, it's it's use that disappointment um, to go and ensure that you're, you know, you're not going to go on a, a kind of a downhill uh, fall now. Um, and can it be one of those? that uh, towards the end of the season if we now focus on our league campaign is it one of those that people look back at and go you know being out of those FA Cup competitions maybe served us alright only we can kind of dictate that so we'll see you, you touched upon it there obviously the next the coming week two big league games Rainers Lane at home on Tuesday uh, Farnham Town away next Saturday as you said you touched upon some of it there I mean how important is it to, to bounce back uh, quickly in those two games and also how much were those two games in your mind, show where we are, you know, against two teams that are probably expected to be up there at the end of the season. How much will those two games show exactly where we are? Oh, I think what you said there, obviously, in regards to two teams being expected to be in and around, you know, the top end of the table, I've seen things when and people will say stuff and say, well, we've played four teams that, you know, you probably on paper should be beaten, but at the end of the day, football ain't played on paper. You know, you have to play the teams that are in front of you. So the four wins from four is something that we're really proud of. Um, we now have, you know, two sides that are, in my opinion, going to be up there um, because of the quality that they've got. And it will be a, you know, it will be a kind of test to see where we're at um, when we're coming up against sides, especially off, a, uh, off a, the back of a loss like today. Um, so there's a couple of tests that will be thrown at us this week. Um, but I'm sure, you know, with, with a bit of you know, fight and spirit that, that we will be okay. Ben, thanks for your time. Good luck this week. Thank you, mate. Appreciate it.